Hello everyone, hope you are all doing very well. Thank you for joining us today. It is another day Yay. and we're bringing to you another edition of Lockdown Cooking Club. Yay. LCC. LCC. I hope you're great. Just waiting for a few minutes as others join in. It's Monday, bank holiday. Easter Monday. Easter Monday, very much important. Easter Monday. I hope you're all doing well. What are you going to say? Oh, I can't tell you. So. It's fine. Hold on, give me just a minute. All right. Hope you all had a good Easter. Happy Easter to you all. Um, we're so grateful to God for another day. We're all alive, we're well, and it's a joy to see you here with us. Just give a few more minutes, as everyone knows, or, you know, others join in. Hey Chanel, hope you're well. It's been a great weekend. It's been a great weekend, in fact, and um, we'll, sh we'll be sure to share all that with you. Today we have another interesting recipe for you to try at home Yay. and we're sure you're going to love it. Yay. Definitely sure you're going to love it. It's a very quick one, I know that quick. Very quick. Quick, 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 quick one. The whole um, aim is 10 pounds under 30 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. I think this will be under 10, or even under 5. If you, oh, wow. okay. if you if you if you shop well <laughs> exactly. if you shop, shop well food. yeah definitely okay definitely so what do we have what well, first of all it's great to come your way once again um, mm -hmm. like i said we are very happy to you know present to you the third edition of lcc it's amazing how it got started you think it was a joke but then we thought oh you you know, this could be something great here, and we hope you've enjoyed us. You know, com you know, um, joining you at, at your home, joining us in our home, mm -hmm. and we hope you are learning from what we are showing you. And most importantly, we hope you are actually trying it exactly. because that's the whole point. Exactly. Right? The aim is that we will do something new, and you can try at home. Some things you might not have ever tried before. Some of them you might have eaten at a restaurant, but then you never knew it was easy to do at home yeah. and the whole aim is that we can show you from here exactly what we're doing you can try from home as well mm -hmm. so definitely please do give it a try and let us know when you do try just post on instagram or facebook and just hashtag lcc hashtag lockdown cooking club or just tag us as well mr and mrs wonderful and we'll be very glad to see what you did at home yeah. add your twist to it that's what people have been doing so yeah. we're adding their own different pastas, mm -hmm. different um, veggies. Veg. Yep. Hey, yeah. have a go. And let us know. Yep. <laughs> have a go and let us know. All right. Have a go and let us know. Yay. Fantastic. Hey everyone, how you doing? Okay, so what do you have for us today, Mrs. Wonderful? What do we have for them today? Well, what do we have for you? <laughs> What are we having today? We are having, or we're going to make a beef curry with turmeric rice. Beef curry, our way. Our way. The wonderful way. Exactly. This is not how you might have it in a restaurant or maybe you might have had it before. This is our way. So please don't criticize. <laughs> Wait till you try it. All right. And yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so it's another quick recipe under 30 minutes, 30 under minutes, 30 yeah. minutes and under, under 10 pounds. 10 pounds. Yeah. Okay, so for the ingredients, we've got one medium sized onion, which I've already um, cut, and then we've got a piece of ginger. We've got two cloves of um, garlic. I've got some fresh 
basso but if you don't have it and you have the dried one you can use that as well and then i've got three um shallots is it shallots <laughs> because i realized i didn't have any more of the white onion so if you have only white onion in the house you can slice one that you will use um to um together with the oil and then you can slice another big one that you you will blend yeah so yeah that is it here and then i've got peas i've got oil vegetable oil um sunflower oil whichever oil you use rice we've got rice two cups of rice because it's just the two of us we've got our main thing which is the beef um diced beef you can get diced beef from tesco wherever around two pound fifty three pounds and then the spices we're gonna use are white pepper black pepper bay leaves curry paprika um cumin and then um chili chili and then i've got this aromat we will list everything um on our page as well so you can have a look and then i've got chilies um crushed chilies for those that want their food very very spicy you can add that at the end um yeah that's all that's all um so let's get started so before we start doing the sauce which will be very very quick i'll time it let's do the let's cook the rice yep. on so we've got our rice cooker rice cooker <laughs> no no the thing is that yeah <laughs> <laughs> what's the rice cooker <laughs> You see how small it is. It's just for the two of us. Just the two of us. <laughs> okay. Do you All want right. to quickly wash it? Yes, please. This? Thank you. Whilst he's doing that, I'll start by putting some oil in our frying pan. Again, it all depends on how many people you are cooking for. By now you know it's just the two of us, so <laughs> that's how it goes. So oil in the pot. Let's get it. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Um. So, okay. So this is now washed. Washed and has water inside. Okay. Obviously, everyone has the rice different. Some people have their rice very sticky. I just like it very, um, what's what I'm looking for? Individual. <laughs> <laughs> so, so yeah, you add, add the water according to your yeah. taste. However you cook your rice in the house. Yeah. And then we're going to add turmeric. Yep, this for the colouring and flavour. I would say one tablespoon. Table tea. Table tea. Teaspoon. 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 Yeah. Okay. Okay, then we'll add salt to taste. Salt to taste, however you prefer your salt in your rice. The rice we are using the normal Costco, the Costco ri uh, Costco rice, rice, yeah. the one with the yellow packet. If you have basmati, whatever you have, whatever you prefer, you can use any type of rice you want. So that's um, salt and then peas, peas are going into the rice. Again, this is our own invention. If you don't like the peas, you can leave them out. Definitely. But it makes it really colorful and very delicious. Can we add mixed veggie one? <laughs> Thing one. And a little bit of oil. And a bit of oil. Okay, so, right. so this goes put that on. here, and that is done. Over here, let's start our sauce. We're gonna put our 
sliced onion and the oil. Pardon the sound. So rice is on. We've got our blendables here, and we've got our beef going on as well. I'll just add a little bit. So how have you guys been? How is everyone doing? How was your Easter day? Yeah, Easter. What have you been up to? Easter weekend. Easter weekend. Good Friday on Friday was amazing. Saturday, re relax. Oh, Saturday was good. Saturday. Yeah. How did you do? Had a whole day of spa. Oh home, yes. Home that, spa treatment. Mm, that was good. Home spa that treatment. Was that was that was amazing. You know, did some pedicure, manicure, manicures, face, facials. Uh, yeah, it was very good. I am considering though, I'm what considering, um, well I've been challenged actually by Daniel Adjerman to let my wife cut my hair <laughs> and shave me because he got his wife to do it for him and she did a great job, I must say. Very yeah. good. <laughs> I'm being challenged to let my wife cut my hair for me and I was asking to tell, the, the beard is going to be on my hand. So, like I said, so we'll see, we'll see. We'll see. Okay, so to this, um, we will now add um, a bit of spices. We're gonna add uh, cumin. Again, one tablespoon. You want to do a tablespoon? Sure. Um, so that Again, I'll be shop. So you hear us mention Aldi all the time. The Mrs. Yeah, sponsor of Jersey. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> right from this, you can smell that um, beef Ooh. curry Ooh. smell or what you get okay. when you go to the restaurant. The restaurant. Alright, okay. Yeah. That's what does it, yeah? This is the main thing. Uh, yeah? I will add another. Why not? Why not? Pop it in. Oh, another teaspoon, okay. Yeah, another teaspoon of that. And I'm going to stir it in, stir it in. Okay. A teaspoon of curry. Curry, yes. Yeah. 
Guys, um, so this is the third edition. So the first time we did Cabanara. Cabanara, yeah, that was that was great. Second time we went for the creamy <laughs> You know I'm laughing, right? Yeah, I know. Creamy prawn Talatele. Thank you. Talatele. Last time he was trying to say it to um oh, my parents. My my mother in law. And the struggle was real, guys. He kept on with um, Teglia, whatever, whatever. At some point, mom was like, Can you just say Talia or something? Then let's move on. Oh my gosh, we were laughing so hard. Talia, tell <laughs> Okay, I'm adding a bit of white pepper. We are seasoning, we are just seasoning the beef, really. Oh, I can smell that. Yeah. Guys, can you smell it? Can you smell it? <laughs> um, black pepper, it's a black pepper. So, oh. yeah. finished? No. Oh, okay. Now it's finished. Okay. I have to shop in this. Yep. You have to write that on the board. Paprika. I'll add one teaspoon of paprika as well. If you have the hot or the spicy curry, then maybe you wouldn't need any more chilies. Right, okay. Um, but if, if not, then you can add a bit of um, chili, which I'm adding. I don't like spicy food, I don't do lots of spice. So but I do. He does, so you try to. I must say, though, you've done well to actually adapt yourself, so you're, I, I can see. You started adding a lot of spice, you know, mm. chili, shall I say, to your, to, to your food. Mm -hmm. So you are enjoying it, so yeah. Right. It's not like I'm really good, but... Aww. <laughs> <laughs> of course you are. Okay. <laughs> it's <laughs> alright, but yeah, I'm enjoying it. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'll add one tablespoon, oh, teaspoon, <laughs> oh my gosh, of um, aromat or whatever. Um, Seasoning you have. Seasoning you have. You can add that. Oh man, the smell. Mm. It smells so good. It really smells good. So right now we already have the color yep. and the, the smell. Oh, definitely have the smell. Now we will add, we will add our... Blender bowls. Yeah, the blended um, onion, garlic okay. and ginger. Okay. This is all done really. Done. It's now 12 minutes since we've been cooking. Alright, so that is beginning to get angry, like I always say. We use home terms. These are not professional terms, right? Because like yeah, you say, yeah, we, we are, are not, not professionals, professionals, no. And we are not caterers, we are not no. we've never worked in a restaurant before. No. Um <laughs> We just happen to love food. Exactly. And She's a like great cook. Events, I'm a great eater. You know the deal? He's a great cook too. He's I just try. trying to be but yeah, and this is our own invention again. So um, it's nice, you will love it, but maybe it won't be as the original version you know if you know. Yeah. This is almost done, guys. Almost we done. Are done. The main thing we're waiting for now is the rice, really, the depending rice. how long that takes. Mm -hmm. But usually, rice can take anywhere between 15 to 20 minutes. Yeah. So once that is done, then food is good to go, good to serve. I know we've been baking as well. Yeah, maybe so. this time we'll bring <coughs> something. Pastry related. Are you happy with that? Very, very happy. Fantastic. The only thing I'll add will be a bit more of the cumin. Oh, wow. Okay. And then I'll add, I'll add some salt. Again, salt to paste, yeah, so then how you Oh, guess what? What? Tomorrow, we are two years old. Oh. <laughs> and I say we, uh, because obviously we got married 
on the 14th of April 2018. So tomorrow is our second year anniversary. It's been amazing marrying this wonderful lady right here. Aww. She's been good. Honestly, she's been good. And you've been wonderful. Well, Mr. Wonderful. <laughs> but yeah, um, yeah um, no, it's been it's been it's been a great journey journey so, so far, far so far and I would believe it's gonna get greater and better as we go on really so tomorrow we are two years happy birthday to us Yay. we did plan to travel outside of the country but now we're gonna to have to resort travel. to traveling internally outside the house inside what so that will be our destination tomorrow hopefully the sun will be out so yeah we go outside to the garden a good sunny day yeah but yeah um we will we'll do a video one time on our first two years yeah. of marriage so look out for that you want to check the rice because this is done this is done how is it it's coming along well okay I'm now going to add uh, basil, basil. Basil. It's just for flavour anyway. Um, for the aroma. Mm. But the sauce is done. Again, as I said earlier, if you don't have the fresh one and you have the, um, the dry, the dry cut, one, chopped ones, you can add that. And also, this is just for two of us. Uh, some yeah. of you might have big families whereby you will need more beef, more, more, onions, of, everything. more of everything basically. Yeah, so do it according to the measure of your family. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If you like spicy food, can never go wrong with your grass chilies. Yeah. I'll put that in now. So this is done. So this was done in, in 20 minutes? 20 minutes, yep. Just so waiting for the rice. We're waiting for the rice and then we'll dish it and we'll show you. Yeah. Um, I hope I didn't add too much water. I think, I think that's why it's so long. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that should... Dip, I mean, we, we had, what, two cups there, so... Did we'll, you measure the water? I didn't measure. I used my eyes. I'm normally good at that, but... I guess we'll find out <laughs> very soon. Yeah. If we'll be having rice pudding. <laughs> Imagine that. Turmeric, turmeric rice pudding. Have we learned an Italian, Caleb? See, si, see, si, see, si, see, si, see. Oh, si, 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 yes, si. yes, yes. Si. Come on, flow, 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 baby. Flow. Um, um, you know what? I learned the alphabet a while ago. Mm -hmm. And it's been a while since I attended to it again. So I think I might need to. But yeah. Um, Come stai? Mm -hmm. um, tutto bene? Okay, what's the meaning of that? It's Come stai means how are you basically? Um, tutto bene is very well, very well. Um, muchas gracias. Oh my god, that's Spanish, baby. Oh, Spanish. Ah, very similar. Same, same difference. <laughs> same difference. <laughs> Brava, brava is when you say well done for a female, and bravo, that's what well done for males. Because obviously, you know, Italian is very masculine and feminine. So, yeah, there's the A for the ladies, is that right? Mm -hmm. And then the O for men. Mm -hmm. well done, um, wow. There's so much more I know, but you know, for the, for the sake of time, we'll just. Oh, quite <laughs> a lot of time. <laughs> <laughs> The rice is so cooking, you know. You've got a lot of time. Come on, you know, I know you know a lot of things. I know, I know. <laughs> well, the, the thing is, yeah, when he used to um, go to work by train, he had enough time to Thank you. Tell them. Tell learn them. Italian files on the train. So during his commute. But he started driving to work and that was the end. And now he's forgotten the few things he learnt. Yeah, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. But it's because, oh my days, you know, sometimes you want to speak Italian with him, but... You do sometimes, just say you things. You are seriously, yeah. you, you want to say something, you know, really quick, and he'll be like, what's the meaning of that? And the words I'm like, you know, let's just... See? How can I learn? I'll, I can't, I can't do it. Take your time. You know, teach me. 
Yeah, I'm going to learn Italian because obviously I need to be careful that when we have our children, she's not, you know, they're not having their secret chats and I'm like, <laughs> always having Google Translate to just waiting for them to talk and I could translate it. So I'm, I'm going to learn, Aww. you know, so they don't bully me. And so we will be speaking what? Italian? We're going to speak Italian, we're going to speak English, we're going to speak Tree, we're going to speak Fante. I'm going to speak a bit of Ga when, 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 when grandma comes over, my parents, and Ada, when, yeah, my dad, my mum, mm -hmm. Ada and Ga, your parents okay. are fancy. What else? I think it's okay for now. I mean, at school, they learn German, <laughs> Spanish. I tried my hands on German, you know that. Yeah, so you can teach them that as well. I tried my hands on Spanish. <laughs> French? French, I Sava. did that when I was in Ghana. Sava. But yeah, um, I think we were limited to Italian, um, English, English, and tree. tree and fancy, definitely. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, they're bilingual, that's the whole point. We can just leave. Stop the clock, it's 30 minutes. 30 minutes, well, the, the sauce is done. The we're rice just, is ready, though. Just waiting for Mr. Wonderful's rice. It's ready. It's, see, it's on warm, it's ready. Can you see that? It's well, on warm. It's not like as soon as it goes on warm, it's ready. It's on warm. It was on warm, so it's been there for a while. So, can we dish? Can we eat and Is it edible? Safe? That's the question. <laughs> During the night. Let me check on the rice. Check on the rice. <laughs> ah, beautiful rice. Beautiful rice. If you say so. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the colour is very beautiful. Exactly. That's all you need. Is it cooked? That's the question. <laughs> <laughs> I think it is anyway. Let me get plates. Do you want to use this to dish it? Okay, so add your sauce. Add your sauce. Some sauce. Do you think women have to know how to cook before marriage? Whoa. Definitely. Do you have to describe I mean, each other? Um. Women have to know how to cook before marriage. What? <laughs> There's a funny story actually. So yesterday I was chatting to my dad in Ghana, um, and he was saying that <laughs> the, lockdown, <laughs> the lockdown is bringing a lot of troubles to marriages or couples at home because some husbands who thought their wives really knew how to cook have just realised that they don't know how to cook because they are they were them, buying the food. They were literally they were buying restaurant food and dishing it out as as though they cooked it themselves so now they've been exposed because they can't go out to get a food anymore so that's just by the, by the way but i don't personally think they have to know how to cook really everything well everything at least they must know the skills of how to cook i i believe uh, cooking is a very vital skill which you gain from growing up at home or even going to uni you know, when you're independent, you know, that's, you know, that skill you, you gain. Mm -hmm. And I believe you can learn much more as well, even after marriage. Mm -hmm. So that's, that's my reason for that, you know. The, the, the only problem is when she is not willing to learn how to cook. Having said that, I think guys also have to do very well to um, know how to cook before marriage as well. It goes vice versa, because sometimes if, if she's at work and I get home first, am I going to sit at home and wait for her to come home and then cook? Da, 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 da. No, no way. So, because I also know how to cook, I can make food. When she's tired, I cook. When, is, when she wants to cook, she cooks. You know, so it makes it a lot more fun if you both know how to cook. Because then it's not always the same person cooking the same old thing. I realise she does sometimes get bored of what she cooks. You know, and she doesn't enjoy what she cooked herself. So I believe being a guy knowing how to cook as well, I can also add in my flavour or my touch and she enjoys that as well. Mm, okay. Okay. So guys, we are done. That's it. And it's bright. Oh no, it's, it, it was it was 30 minutes, definitely. Oh. It's definitely not now, but it was 30 minutes. This is it. And that's it. Can you bring the thing closer? Oh, let me see. Let me see. Mm. That's your turmeric rice with beef curry. Yeah. The wonderful style. The wonderful way. Our way. Try it and let us know what you think about it. 
if you have any other recipe that is the same, you can let us know as well and we will try it. Um, yeah. I'll let you taste it this time because I've been tasting for the past two oh, episodes. Really? Yeah. Okay, do you want to quickly take a picture of it? Oh yes. Check out. Do you want to try that? Yeah. It's always important we try it live for you to see. <laughs> if it's not nice, you see it. <laughs> There's no editing. Alright. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Oh, Esther, trust me, it will definitely taste yummy. Honest. The rice. That's good. Oh, get in there! Mm. Come on! Thank you very much. The rest is cooked. It is cooked. It's cooked. Alright, easy, easy, easy. <laughs> Alright, take your time. <laughs> Alright, guys, um, that's been the sauce. Uh, mm. The sauce is good as well. Mmm, mm. 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 I can tell. Mmm, yeah, mmm. She's enjoying it, guys. But yeah, that's good. Very good. Um, today, I thought I'd bring you another word of encouragement. You know, and as you can see by my t shirt, <laughs> it is good to give thanks. Okay? It is good to give thanks. And that is coming from the Bible, um, Psalm 92, Psalm 92, and verse 1. It is good to give thanks. And I believe in these times where you can see all around you, a lot of people are dying. A lot of people are falling ill and being um, stricken by this virus. Lots of people are dying. Lots of people are dying. It is very important that you appreciate life in general. Mm -hmm. And therefore you give thanks for the things that you have. And don't focus too much on the things that you don't have. Because now we're realizing how essential life in itself is. And how unessential or, you know, a few and other things are. Mm -hmm. you know, people are now realizing, wow, spending time with family is very essential. Um, being at home with loved ones, um, appreciating life in itself because people think they are strong. You know, the strong, pe strong people have died, rich people have died, poor people have died, every race is dying. So it's not a matter of a particular class of people or race or gender, everybody. Can be affected by this virus and therefore the life that you have appreciate it thank god for it yeah. you know god has given us life and it is for a number of years it is not guaranteed that you will live forever and therefore the number of years that you're going to be here for every day when you wake up it's, it's our practice that we wake up and we thank god for our life because we could have gone to bed and not have woken up mm -hmm. in the morning but the fact that we do wake up it is an opportunity for us to live again and to do something new all right so see every new day as a new page in the book see every new month as a new chapter and see every new year as a new book mm. all right if you look at it in that way i'm sure you will appreciate it a lot better you know you can you can tend to go deeper and say see every second as a new sentence blah, 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 blah. but you, you get a point all right life mm. is amazing enjoy it live it and be thankful to god for what you have. Count your blessings and name them one wow. by one. And it will surprise you Wonderful. what God has done for you. All right. So yeah, guys, we've enjoyed bringing your way third edition of Lockdown Cooking Club. We've done beef curry with turmeric, rice, and peas. Mm -hmm. And like you saw our earlier, own our own way. It's not the restaurant way, it's our own way. And try it at home, let us know, post it. Um, tag us, Mr. and Mrs. Wonderful, hashtag LCC, hashtag Lockdown Club. Quick recipe is another £10 under, under 30 minutes. Under £10? Under, pound? 10 under 30 pounds. No, under 10 pounds. <laughs> I under think it's 30 time minutes. to eat. <laughs> it's All time right. to eat now. So, guys, try it and let us know how it goes. If you enjoyed this video and other ones, do check out all our other videos as well. Um, and well, if, you, if you've enjoyed this one, as usual, please like, comment, and obviously subscribe, okay, so you'll be notified whenever we come on, and do share with others. Let others get to know about 
other recipes that they can also try at home and I'm sure they will love it just like you do. Right. Have, Have a blessed week.